Hi, Construction Association. It's me, uh, David Eby, Premier of BC. Really good to see you. Thank you for reaching out uh, to talk about uh, construction in our province and uh, why I think uh, Construction Association members should be uh, supporting a BC NDP government. Uh, you build things, and we're a government that builds things too. We have a fast-growing province, added 180,000 people to our province in the last 12 months. We have to build the roads, transit systems, electrical systems, schools, hospitals, and we can't stop. The other parties have been very clear. Uh, they want to cut the budget. They want to reduce government spending. And that means less support for people at a time when they really need it. When our population is growing, we can't afford to keep living in our grandparents' infrastructure. We got to keep building. And it's not just the public sector. We're leading Canada in housing starts despite a high interest rate environment, building the homes that people need, both rental and for purchase. All the things that you build, we need them in our province. We're a government that builds, and we know we can't build them without you. That's why we're also training the workforce for the future through apprenticeship programs on government construction projects so that you have the skilled workers you need for your businesses to respond to construction demand in your communities. It's something we didn't do for a generation. We brought in uh, foreign workers to work side by side at lower wages to BC workers, depriving young people of apprenticeship opportunities. We can't do that anymore. We need to train up our population to build our province and we're going to do it together. And I'm so glad uh, to be invited to be do the, uh, doing this uh, with you. And I hope you talk to the other parties uh, because this, the choice will be very stark on October 19th about the party that wants to build our province and respond to the growth and the demand and the prosperity that everyone in this province deserves and the parties that just want to cut. And that means jobs and that means wait lists and that means problems for people. And we're both builders, so let's get building.